Hello and welcome to Rhymes with Bart. I'm Bart and this is Collector's Clearance. I had been wanting to do a bunch more unboxing videos and uh, I was lamenting the fact that I couldn't afford to buy, you know, $150 collector's editions. And I was in the store and I saw this guy, uh, which was originally uh, 80 bucks. This is the South Park Stick of Truth Grand Wizard Edition. Um, and I thought to myself, why can't I just do videos of, of uh, you know, older uh, collector's editions that have been around for a long time? And then I was like, wait a minute, why can't I do that? So I'm going to. It was originally $80. I got it for 29 which is pretty awesome. Uh, so uh, I'm very curious to see what uh, Cartman looks like. So let's take a look. And of course, like always, I forgot to bring something to open the box. All right, so somewhere around here are some scissors. Just trying to do it without damaging the box, you know. There we go. So the, bo the box is actually pretty, I, I didn't really display it, but you can see on the sides there's some pretty awesome uh, art of the characters. And then the back has all the info. So inside has, first of all, the game. South Park Stick of Truth. There you go. So I played this game for about 15 minutes, uh, maybe a year and a half ago. Uh, and it was cool. Uh, I liked it a lot and I was like, I gotta play more of this. I was surprised and impressed by how much like an episode it seemed, um, like in the graphics and everything. But uh, I never got back to it and eventually I was just like, I don't think I'm ever gonna play this because I'm playing so many other things. So I, um, I just, uh, I, I got rid of it. And that was kind of silly, but now I'll, I'll give it another try. Um, it also comes with um, the Ultimate Fellowship Pack. This is basically a collection of uh, DLC, um, extra uh, characters. Yeah, that's mainly, it's mainly just um, like extra uh, character classes you can play. Uh, Necromancer, Sorcerer, Ranger, Elf, Holy Defender, Rogue Assassin. And then there's the big thing that comes, oh wait, oh I forgot about this, that's right. So it comes with the <laughs> hand-drawn map of uh, the South Park Kingdom. Let's see if I can show this properly. Uh, can you see that? Not really here on me. Give that a better view. That's pretty cool. But that's really neat. Um, obviously it's not actually hand-drawn, but, um, but it's neat. It's made to look like, you know, a kid's hand-drawn map. Um, and it's got all the silly stuff. You got the uh, ginger ogres down here, <laughs> Stark's Pond, uh, Blackbeard's Cove. So yeah, that's really neat. The graphics are, I mean, the uh, the visuals are really neat too. Look at that. There's the, there's the castle. <laughs> all right. That's cool. I'm gonna put that up on the wall. And now, the big piece. Ah. The statue of Grand Wizard Cartman. There we go. Wow, that's terrific. Comes with a little staff. Let's see. Will that go right in his hand? It will. Look at that. <laughs> that's great. So here's the statue of Cartman in his Grand Wizard, like the sewn on star on the on the hat <laughs> and the cape. That is really great. So this is a, this is a um, this is a pretty well designed statue. It's hefty. Um, it's solid. It doesn't feel like it's gonna like snap in my hands. Um, the painting on the eyes is a little bit eh, a little bit suspect. Ooh, he's staring at you. No. But uh, <laughs> no, this is this is really nice. I like it. Um, better quality statue than I've seen in. A lot of uh, collectors' editions, and yeah, I like the painting work, the design work. So this is this is. I mean, he's so round. This is exactly how you would imagine him um, if he wasn't a two-dimensional uh, a two-dimensional character most of the time. But yeah, and the like detachable walking stick, really nice. So yeah, this is. Uh, so I would say that you know when this when this set came out, it was eighty dollars, 
And um, I am really, I, I like collector's editions, but I always think that they're overpriced. Um, $80 is actually on the low side for a collector's edition, especially one with a statue. So I'm kind of, I'm kind of thinking this one might not have been that bad when it first came out, but 80 bucks is still a bit much. 30 on the other hand is great. Uh, now they're hard to find because of course they've been out of print for a long time, but if you can find one that, you know, they're, they're discounted because the game is old. I'm gonna be doing a bunch more of these, I think, because they're really fun and I've been able to track down a few other ones. Um, some fun collector's editions, other ones with statues, some without, but it's fun to do unboxing videos. And I hope, uh, I hope if you're watching this, you really enjoyed it and uh, you'll come back and see the other ones, which I'll do in the near future. So thanks for watching. If you liked, please uh, like and favorite, subscribe to the channel, and uh, I'll see you next time. Thanks very much. Bye.